Good morning, everyone. Welcome to my channel. Welcome to my video. Uh, today, as you know, is July 3rd, and the uh, markets are closed. So what we're going to do is we're going to cover our uh, closed positions and where we are in our spreadsheets. Okay, uh, as you can see, my uh, legal disclosure there. It's enough time on it. Uh, you guys have been seeing that every day. So let's move on over here to the market that happened yesterday. Okay, the markets, uh, they stayed higher yesterday. Uh, they tried to dip close to the red after uh, they came out big, powerful green because uh, more Americans went back to work. These are not new jobs that they created. It was the same jobs that they lost. All the employers did was uh, ask them to come back to work underneath the PPP program. Remember, uh, we spent trillions of dollars out there for businesses to keep people hired back on and hire people back. So uh, we artificially um, uh, pumped up the companies by giving them cash to keep their workers hired. So that's what we done. And that's why people are getting hired back. Not because the companies are making money. It's only because we pay companies to keep their employees or to hire them back under the PPP program. Uh, we have never done that in the history of America, but uh, apparently we, we did it this time, and we use a lot of debt to, to give to uh, business owners to hire these people back. Well, at least uh, the CEOs and everybody, they got their billions of dollars of uh, a payroll and their senior leadership as. So. Okay, uh, ET, at, it closed out above our seven seven dollar mark for those thousand shares and I'll show it to you in a minute um, our cruise line it stayed above the 1450 so it got caught away too so uh, let's get let's get busy let's get out of here and let's go straight to the account okay let's look at our options okay our cruise lines all that premium see that premium well some of that stuff was real money remember we went 1450, so we went deep in the money. Okay, remember the share price was around 1550 when we done this. So even though the the market went up, uh, we had deep in the money. We received deep in the money. Uh, we did a deep in the money covered call on this. Okay, now the other one got called away, the other 10 ET at the $7 mark. Remember, we purchased that at $7.20. Remember, we thought it was going to pop up and then we could get another $7.50 call, but it didn't work out that way. So what we done was we just, uh, we just did uh, a, you know, a $0.23 cent, uh, covered call against her. So we made uh, two hundred and thirty-three dollars and forty-nine cents. Now this is after the trading fees. Just so you guys know, they take the trading fees out while you're looking at these numbers here. So uh, ET down here, we only have a thousand shares left. Okay, in Norwegian Cruise, we have zero shares left because they got called away. They got assigned. All right. Now let's look at our balance real quick. Woohoo! $31,780. Remarkable. Okay. Remember, uh, we still have one more one option out, and plus everything has to settle. So uh, this won't be the number we'll be using, but uh, it's it looks good though. All right, that's enough of this here. All right, let's go on to our spreadsheet. Okay, the two items that got assigned was uh, our cruise line, the option got assigned. So we picked up $715. So we picked up almost a 5% return. Now, I remember that ET, all we did was basically got our money back 
but we pulled out an extra thirteen dollars out of the deal okay because uh, remember ET has some negative news against that uh, one company that was filing bankruptcy and that's why I pulled the trigger here I put a covered call against her at the sevens uh, just to just to pull you know to get our profits out I mean just to get the the principal out the real money that we had invested plus a couple of bucks <clears throat> so uh, we still have the other ET position here that don't expire the option don't expire until uh, if I'm correct this is supposed to be the 17th yeah all right yeah this is the 17th yeah I think I messed up here yeah it's probably the 17th okay we got the 750 uh, covered call on that one um, and it's still in the works so we'll see how this plays out if we have to we'll put another covered call all the way until we get another dividend again no big deal and it, then it gets called away so what we have now is we have this this profit that we received okay now we put the profit over here on our monthly stock tracker okay so far we received a 2.48 percent return on our money in one month even though we're in our first week so this is going to be an interesting month i don't know we might be able to beat our 5.36 percent for last month we'll see or for june remember these are June numbers even though it says July 1st okay that's how it works all right we started off in May and the beginning of June here we started off with a total of almost 26,000 the beginning of July July 1st we started off with twenty nine thousand three hundred eighty four dollars now we're in July 3rd here and you know we don't count that until at the end of the month this is for the end of month roll up here or the beginning of the month for August 1st so uh, we're, we're looking good on the tracker here our five-year plan over here is looking real good okay that was the beginning of the month 29,384 Remember, we have to achieve $882 for 3%, okay, for the month of July. And we're still adding more funds. We've added $1,500 in the last couple days. And we'll add more to it. Now, now we're still on track in our five-year plan. To achieve over six hundred thousand, and we're still going to achieve our million dollars. We're going to break that million dollars in October of two thousand and twenty-six. So far, that so we'll have one point two, uh, one million twenty-six thousand dollars in October first. That's on October first of two thousand. And 26 so that's six and a half years okay so let's get back up here okay so now what I got to do is I got to pick a couple of stocks for Monday or for next week so we're looking at some airlines and I'm looking at a cruise line. I'm thinking about getting on my cruise line again here that likes to pay us each week. Um, I might pick some of that up and I might even pick up some Carnival Cruise this time. So uh, we'll see. We'll see. I'll go through uh, my socks and see what we pick. And then we'll do another covered call on Monday and Wednesday. I'm hoping that Monday might be, you know, maybe the market will drop down to, down into the red a little bit, 
and it's better when we do our covered calls when it's in the red a little bit. I think the market is still too high, and uh, we'll go from there. Now, uh, let me keep this video short today. I want you guys to all enjoy your weekend, uh, your holiday, and be safe out there with your families. And remember, give this video a thumbs up. And, uh, and remember, subscribe so you can immediately get the videos when they come out. Okay? Everybody enjoy your happy 4th of July. Okay? And this is Sunny. I'm out.